This introduction to the oropharynx was brought to you by Head and Neck Cancer Australia for the benefit of patients and families affected by oropharyngeal cancer. The throat, also known as the pharynx, has three parts. The middle part is the oropharynx, which is located directly behind the mouth. Structures that make up the oropharynx include tonsils, the soft palate, the back wall of the throat, the base of the tongue, and the vollecula, where the tongue joins the voice box. The oropharynx has two main functions. It allows air to pass from either the nose or mouth through the voice box into the lungs. It also pushes food and water from the mouth down the esophagus to the stomach. Cancer that starts anywhere in the oropharynx is called oropharyngeal cancer. Your doctor may also refer to it by the specific location, such as tonsil or base of tongue cancer. Oropharyngeal cancer can cause symptoms including a persistent sore throat, difficulty swallowing, earache, difficulty opening the mouth, or change in voice. These symptoms may not be due to oropharyngeal cancer. However, if you have any of these symptoms for more than a few weeks, talk to your doctor so that problems can be diagnosed and treated as early as possible. Cancers in the oropharynx are difficult to see, even for doctors. Often the first sign of oropharyngeal cancer is a lump in the neck because cancers can spread into the lymph nodes in the neck. Lymph nodes are bean-shaped glands in the neck that are part of the immune system's defence against infection. Oropharyngeal cancers can be treated with surgery or radiation therapy. Many patients receive a combination of treatments, including chemotherapy. Depending on the size and the location of the cancer, your specialist will suggest treatment options that are suitable for you.